Hello everyone, this is Robert again, coming at you with another video. Today's video, I will be trying my hands at making natural cordage out of cattail leaves. Now, I'll, I will be making a reverse wrap cordage, or reverse twist cordage. First, I'm gonna tie these two leaves into a knot. When I get it started, now I'm gonna twist, wrap it around. and keep doing this till I get to the end. Now I had these leaves soaking in the stream over here. Hopefully it softened it up a little bit so it can be more pliable and it won't tear as easy. I chose this area of a little stream because it was a little bit more, well, quite a bit more quiet than the main stream that I usually cross because that was flowing pretty good and it was kind of loud. So I wanted to make sure you could hear me and not just the flowing water. I've done this with um, regular sisal twine, dried sisal twine from a big roll that I have. And it was pretty easy. It held up pretty good. It stayed twisted. Unlike this is, this isn't really staying twisted that much. I don't know if I'm doing it correctly or if this is just too moist and it's not holding within one each other. Well, there's, there it is. Reverse twist of cattail leaves. Now this, is, this may not really be that strong, but if you're just holding something light up or tying something light, it should be pretty good. And if you don't have any rope or paracord with you, Happen to find some cattail leaves. You should be able to use it for a small amount of cordage. It's not going to hold up a cabin or a big lean to. Maybe if you braid it, this, these cattail leaves are starting to rip up and everything. But, in a pinch, 
in a, in a survival situation should do okay. At least you have some type of cordage to tie whatever you need to tie up. See, this is unraveling. I don't know if I'm not doing it correctly or if it's just not holding tight enough. But if you wrap it up the opposite way, but if you let it go, it untwists. Well, this is the first time I've ever tried making natural cordage out of cattail leaves. So, I'll keep practicing with this. So, again, keep practicing with natural cordage, your shelter building, your fire making, and all other types of bushcraft because practice is the key to survival. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video of my attempt to make natural cordage out of a cattail leaves. This is Robert, thank you for watching.